Okay, install app exchange packages. You know what? We just did that in the previous module, but we are going to do it again. And I'm going to show you again, I think the third time on how to change your password for your Trailhead Playground. So go to your hands on org here. I'm going to pop it up here. You can log in from here, right? So I'm going to log into Playful Wolf, log into your own and here, where do you go? Tell me. Go to yeah, setup. That's right. Go to setup on here and setup. And go to users. Users here. No, oh, users. And then you have to change your password. All right. Users here. So here you have your trail hat users right this is your user or whatever your name is so this is your username that's important this is uh, this is what you use for logging in not your own email address but then you have to edit the user edit the record edit the user and change this to your own email address why well because when you reset the password it is going to send a link to this email if this is a scrambled email address like this you won't get it will you you won't so change this to your own email address and then you save it so you have this user still this is the username not your email but you have set that to your email address here I, um, I didn't show it the email on this column but then you can Check the box here and reset password. That will actually reset the password and send you the link to reset the password to the email you just set. So that's how you reset your Trailhead user password. I'm not going to do that again and um, waste time for you and me. I'm going to copy this. I think I remember what my password is. So this is the username I'm copying. All right. So head over to App Exchange. App Exchange. And then you log in with your Trailhead user. If you want to install stuff to your own, then you can log into your own org. So that's the user. Okay. And then my password. And I think, aha, I got it the first try. The password. <laughs> So you are logged in. So you have do that. You're logged in. I'm going to close this out. It has served its purpose. Now you can throw it out. Throw it out. <laughs> throw it out. Boom. So now you're logged in. I am logged in to my um, org. Now, actually, if I log in again, I just want to see if the dashboard is installed on my on this playground so I'm going to go to my setup here and packages installed packages let's see do we have the dashboard adoption no nope. blankety blank so we can install the example from here if I go to the challenge boom brrrm. we've discussed all of this on the previous video okay actually we did. So I'm going to skip over all the way to the challenge. And then we are going to install uh, Salesforce adoption dashboard. That's it. Pretty much it. So I'm going to copy that and search on the top here. Boom. Salesforce adoption dashboard. I want this place. And I'm just going to get it now, right now. I can't wait no more. Production, sandbox. So Trailhead Playground is production. You only have a sandbox if you are managing your own organizations, organizations, um, Salesforce instance. You can deploy a sandbox and install it there to play around. But now we are going to install in Playground, which is a production. Okay. So... I'm going to edit my profile here. 
again. Country is Canada. <laughs> Safe. Boom. And nope, I don't want that. Confirm and install. Oh, again, again, again. Come on. Don't you remember already, Mr. Trailhead? I just need to copy my username again because it's a weird looking username. Here. That's my username. And login again. So what's my password? Can you guess? I don't think so. <laughs> oh, I don't want it. I don't want it. <laughs> just install it already. So you can install for admins only, system administrators, or everybody or specific profiles. I'm just going to install it for all users and hit install. This is coffee time. So I'm going to drink my coffee. Make it sound so you can hear it. Now, still not done. By the time it's done, if you go back here and you go to packages, install packages, boom. Salesforce adoption dashboard. It's done. So you can actually browse the dashboard we have just installed on here. And if I search for dashboards, we should have a bunch of new dashboards, not recent. I don't want recent. I want all dashboard, right? See user adoption, key feature, blah, blah, blah. So let's take a look at one. I think it's going to be beautiful or not because we don't have any data. <laughs> well, it has something there, right? So we just install it and I think we're done. We're going to check the point and grab our 500 points and a new badge, new badge. Ooh, come on. The reports from the app exchange package exists. The reports from the app exchange exists. What did that mean, huh? What does that mean? Oh, we already have 500 points. Nope. Let's refresh this. That is weird. We missed the boom. We missed the boom and we missed the new badge. Not fair. Anyways, we got it. So if you have that, that's fine. Sometimes it glitches when you check the pack, uh, the, the, the challenge. I'll see you on the next module. Good job, guys. Hit that subscribe button and explore new trailhead grounds and learn to implement the most useful and popular apps on the Salesforce app exchange and do yourself a favor like this video and you'll be surprised on how much more you understand when watching this same video after liking it. Don't take my word. Watch this one more time after you like the video and see it for yourself. Bada bing, bada boom.